Welcome back to eBuyer. Today we're unboxing the brand new AMD Radeon RX 7600 uh, GPU and I'm very excited to get into this. Let's just straight away get into it. So we have the Sapphire Pulse version of the GPU today. So we're going to be looking at that one. And obviously on the box you have your all the information you'll ever need. So right on the front, we have obviously the title, the overclocker symbol, obviously you can overclock this. We have the eight gigabyte version, HDMI and display port adjacent. So on the back, it has all your perfect AM AMD uh, RDNA 3 architecture, which is the brand new one. Um, so you've got your record screen, um, record and stream, your crisp and clear um, AMD noise suppression, which I'm a really big fan of, uh, your brilliant color accuracy and all of that. So let's just immediately get into it before we get into any more. a box within a box <laughs> Oof. it's a really nice box obviously the recycled cut in there so straight away we have our graphics card quick installation guide and obviously our little certificate to see so we'll pick this out close that up put that to one side really nicely packaged for that bubble wrap right there let's get it out so obviously, right on the base plate, we have the beautiful uh, Radeon and Sapphire Pulse art. I'm obviously a, quite a big fan of the Sapphire art on the actual devices themselves. Obviously, you've got the click on the uh, on the fans as well, the dual, dual fans. This has the AMD RDNA3 architecture, which is the same architecture that they have on the RX 7900 XT and the XTX version of those GPUs. So obviously, it's quite a high-end architecture on quite a budget GPU, which is fantastic. I've got to admit, I am quite a big fan of the art. I thought, um, obviously it doesn't have any RGBs or anything like that on it, so I thought I'd be quite like, ah, it's just basic and black. It's actually really quite nice, quite sleek. Be really good in like a low profile build. Um, on top of that, you've obviously got your heat sinks and all your beautiful stuff inside of it. We've also got your eight pin um, cable, obviously. So that's a good power source in there. We do recommend somewhere around the 550 uh, PSU kind of wattage. Um, on the front, we also have the three uh, display ports and your one HDMI there. Quite a good spread for your basic GPU. So this has 32 compute units, 32 ray accelerators, as well as uh, 32 megabytes of infinity cache. So it's a bit of a spec bump from the RX 6600. Your ray accelerators are just to speed up performance overall. And obviously with the architecture, um, it's a lot better than last year's or the second gen uh, attempts at this. So AMD are positioning this as a affordable budget um, kind of uh, 1080p gaming GPU and that's pretty good for the price range that it's at. It's quite good for the architecture and obviously the ability that it has. Now it may just be a 1080p gaming card, obviously quite power efficient, but you can obviously push that a lot further with the Fidelity FX superior resolution. And obviously this carries that, so that's great. So this is a uh, eight gigabytes of GDDR6 RAM um, and it has a 128 uh, bit float. Obviously it's quite a good budget GPU, obviously for that sleeker build, that more low profile build, or if you're a beginning PC builder, this is obviously a pretty good choice. It also supports the new uh, video encoder, AV1, so that's very good if you're obviously looking to start making like videos and other subjects like that or just using any sort of editing software. Thank you for watching this unboxing of this AMD Radeon RX 7600 uh, GPU. If you'd like to get yours, you can check the description down below and get it over at eBuyer. So thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one.